thing for me to do is to speak to the people of Lagos. Let me look at the camera. Lagosians, I need to let you know this. What has happened at the center cannot and will not have any effect whatsoever on the decision we're going to take in this coming election in the state of Lagos. The same manner in which we collapse all party affiliations to vote for that personality we, we wanted, we will repeat the same by putting our best foot forward and choose that strong-willed individual that we take our state out of this marauders. What we're speaking to is that we will call all, my, all out, irrespective of what has happened at the center, and take our state. I am ready, Jando is ready. I've heard so many things coming from the sitting government, they're approaching Jando. Read my lips. I am not backing down. This is the eight years on this. This is our last lap. We're going to take our Lagos who win this election landslide. Like I said, the same manner we collapsed party affiliation and decided to say it is that personality that we want, we will do it. And I want to speak to our brothers, the Igbo extraction, that is in Lagos, of Igbo extraction in Lagos. I'm going to be your governor, that governor that will consider you as a crucial part of the state. And take it from me, nobody, I'm a Lagosian of the first order, nobody will harass you in this state, come all out on Saturday and take a decision. Let me remind you, they did everything on Saturday to vandalize and disrupt the election. But at the end of the day, people's will prevail. The same thing we're going to repeat. There is no how anybody would have capacity to, to destroy the entire 13,325 polling units in Lagos. No, nobody. This election, we're going to make a statement to say, whatever has happened at the center is inconsequential. I am ready to speak with other contenders and other political parties. Let us come together and put our best foot forward. Mere emotions won't do this. It is our decision to take this Lagos out of them, and we will win it. It worries me that we have people attacking everybody everywhere under the watch of a sitting gov governor, and not a single statement to condemn that. We will install a government all of us will be proud of and call our own. I am Jando. Since the beginning of this campaign, Jando and Funke have rigorously traversed all wards in Lagos State, from Ikorudu to Bedagri, Ekpe to Alimosho, seeking to know the true state of our state and where the shoe really pinches. They visited the riverine communities and places that have never been visited before by any governorship candidate in the history of Lagos politics. Funke's market storm is also the first of its kind by a deputy governorship candidate Lagos, there's so much work to do. It is time to give the man who knows Lagos and can birth a breath of fresh air the chance to lead. Vote Dr. Abulaziz or Lajide Adediran Jando as governor of Lagos State. PDP power to, to the, the people. people. Candidate who's going to be the 16th governor of Lagos State. <laughs> Anything at all that the Jando brand must have achieved couldn't have been possible without your blessing. So anything, and I do recognize that. Baba, Sherry, and one LGA chairman, you must be a lot of chair here. Or more, you have been more, more she that that more to go. To go, Balaba, don't she party? Man, so for me, the pressure is daily. See, Baba, but I'm not a man, baby. I'm not a man. I'm not a man, baby. We should just watch the news. I'm full of fear. I'm full. I'm in my body. I'm full. Say more. Oni, eh, Lori Muni. Ah, growing up, Timba ti share. Mama told me to make bread and bread. Me no sumo. I was just talking about the big ballet. Oh, I show a wallywa. I'm talking big ballet. I'm wallywa.
Sunday, 19th February, the Vice Presidential Candidate of the People's Democratic Party, His Excellency Governor Ifai Okoa, in company of his Edo State counterpart, His Excellency Governor Godwin Obasaki, just after the town hall meeting of the non yoruba speaking Lagosians, Jando, in company of Governor Ifai Okoa, Governor Godwin Obasaki, and the leadership of the PDP in Lagos, received the entire LGA and ward structures of the African Democratic Congress ADC across the 20 local government areas of Lagos State into the PDP. <laughs> Chairman of all the LGA chairman of the party, Chief Ijao Gbomo, in his speech says it has become very paramount for the structure of the party to pledge their support towards the electoral victory of the Jando Funke gubernatorial ticket and the Atiku Okowa presidential ambition. Thereafter, it was time for the official presentation of the PDP flag to the defectors by His Excellency Senator Dr. Ifai Okua. I must thank our government and for working so hard, for reaching out to all, because we need the collective strength of each and every one of us to change things in Lagos. It is on this note that I wish to formally present the flag of the winning party.
just after that. But your coming is a blessing and it is a testimony to the fact that I am mean, that I am not just here doing my bidding. I am representing the party at the national level as well. So when they say they are coming to work for us, I said, it's not me that they are coming to work for us, they are coming to work for the party from top to bottom. And thank God uh, they've seen it. And I'm sure they'll be here today to make them more lionized. I will go on the streets of Lagos to come out for PDP next week. 25th of February is just six days away. I know that you're very eager to take over Lagos State after Mr. Jandon to become governor of the state. God bless you. And I know that it will surely happen by the grace of God. But the easiest pathway is to ensure that the Atiko Koa ticket wins the election next Saturday. and it shall be won by the special grace of God. Once that election is won, you know that there will be a people in effect here. And the so-called ownership in Lagos will have come to with just a few days to the general election, Dr. Abdulaziz Olaji Diadidiron Jandor continues to receive more defectors into the PDP, many of whom couldn't stop admiring his doggedness that has never been seen before in the history of Lagos politics.